Barocco coffee is known for its strong and bold flavor. It has a rich, full-bodied taste with a distinct aroma. The coffee beans are known for their unique earthy and fruity notes. Barocco coffee is native to the Philippines and is grown primarily in the high-altitude regions of Batangas, Cavita, and some parts of other neighboring provinces. The name, Barako, is derived from the Tagalog word meaning, stud, or wild boar, because of its strong and robust qualities. Barako coffee is made from the Liberica coffee beans, which is one of the rarest and lesser-known coffee species in the world. Liberica coffee trees are larger than other coffee species and have distinctive large leaves and cherries. Barako coffee has a long history in the Philippines. It was introduced by Spanish colonizers in the 18th century and became a popular choice among the locals. It played a significant role in the country's coffee industry during the Spanish colonial period. The cultivation and harvesting of Barako coffee beans are labor-intensive. The coffee cherries take a longer time to mature, and the beans are typically hand-picked to ensure only the ripe ones are harvested. This meticulous process contributes to the high-quality flavor of the coffee. The production of Barocco coffee is relatively limited compared to other coffee varieties. The trees are susceptible to diseases and pests, making it more challenging to cultivate on a large scale. As a result, Capeng Barocco is considered a specialty coffee and is often sought after by coffee enthusiasts. Barocco coffee has become a cultural icon in the Philippines. It is often associated with traditional Filipino hospitality and is served as a welcoming drink to guests. It has also gained popularity as a souvenir item for tourists visiting Batangas, where it is particularly renowned. Like other types of coffee, Barocco coffee contains caffeine, which can provide a temporary energy boost and increase alertness. Coffee also has antioxidant properties and may offer various health benefits when consumed in moderation. While Barocco coffee is commonly enjoyed as a hot beverage, it can also be used in other culinary applications. It is sometimes used in cooking and baking to add a unique flavor to desserts, sauces, and marinades. Due to the challenges faced in cultivating Barocco coffee, there have been efforts to preserve and revive its production. Local farmers, government agencies, and coffee enthusiasts are working together to promote sustainable cultivation practices and preserve this unique coffee variety. Batangas, the province known as the coffee capital of the Philippines, is particularly renowned for its production of Barocco coffee. The favorable climate and soil conditions in this region contribute to the exceptional quality of the coffee. Barocco coffee is often associated with masculinity due to its strong and bold qualities. It has gained a reputation as a man's coffee in Filipino culture, often enjoyed by men during social gatherings or as a morning pick-me-up. Barocco coffee was once considered a status symbol during the Spanish colonial period. Its exclusivity and rich flavor made it a beverage of choice for the upper class and elite. The robust flavor of Barocco coffee makes it an excellent choice for creating specialty coffee drinks such as espresso, cappuccino, and even coffee cocktails. Its bold character can withstand the addition of milk and other flavorings while still maintaining its distinct taste. Barocco coffee has a loyal following among coffee enthusiasts who appreciate its unique qualities. It has gained recognition internationally with coffee lovers from different parts of the world seeking out this rare and exceptional coffee variety. In recent years, there has been a resurgence of interest in Barocco coffee, with efforts to promote its cultivation, revive its production, and support local farmers. This renewed appreciation for the coffee has brought it back into the spotlight and introduced it to a new generation of coffee enthusiasts. Barocco coffee has been recognized as a cultural heritage product by the Philippine government, acknowledging its historical and cultural significance to the country's coffee industry. The name, Barocco, not only represents the coffee's strong qualities but also reflects the resilience and determination of Filipino coffee farmers who have preserved and nurtured this unique coffee variety throughout the years.